good day everyone our topic for today is about GMDSS its subsystem and the safety precautions on how to handle the GMDSS another important activity that we are going to conduct later on is sending the SC alert via VHF MF or HF radio and also how to send an alert by communication the following abbreviations such as GMDSS DSC, VHF, MF or HF, and others will also be enlightened later. So take out your notebooks and stay tuned. What is GMDSS? The GMDSS or Global Maritime Distress Safety System is an internationally recognized distress and radio communication safety systems for ship replacing the previous ship-to-ship -ship safety system which relied on a manual Morse code system on 500 kHz and voice radio telephony on channel 16 and 2182 kHz. The GMDSS is an automated ship-to-shore system using satellites and digital selective calling technology. The GMDSS is mandated for ships internationally by the International Maritime Organization Safety of Life at Sea Convention 1974 as amended in 1988 and carries the force of an international treaty. Let us now go for distress communications. A distress message indicates that a mobile unit or person is threatened by grave and imminent danger and requires immediate assistance. A distress message has absolute priority over all communications. Distress calls transmitted by radio telephony are prefixed by the spoken word may they sent three times. Subsequent messages are preceded by the word may they only once. A distress message is often preceded by a distress alert using DSC or the digital selective calling. Next is the urgency communications. An urgency message indicates that the calling station has a very urgent message concerning the safety of a mobile unit or person. An urgency message has priority over all other communications excepting distress. Urgency message transmitted via radio telephony are prefixed by the word pan pan sent to three types. An urgency message is often preceded by an urgency alert using digital selective calling. Safety communications. A safety message indicates that a calling station has an important navigational or meteorological warning to transmit. A safety message has priority over all communications excepting distress and urgency. Safety messages sent via radio telephony are prefixed by the word Security sent three times. A safety message can be preceded by a safety alert using digital selective calling. Routine communications. A routine message is one not covered by the previous categories. Public correspondence communications are those which are used to convey routine information between persons on board and those ashore through the public telecommunications network. Example of public correspondence communications are by telephone, fax, email, and data messages. What is DSC? DSC stands for Digital Selective Calling. It allows mariners to instantly send an automatically formatted distress alert to the Coast Guard or other rescue authority anywhere in the world. Digital selective calling also allows mariners to initiate or receive distress, urgency, safety and routine radio telephone calls or from any similarly equipped vessel or shore station without requiring either party to be near a radio loudspeaker. A DSC acts like the dial and bell of a telephone allowing you to direct dial and ring other radios or allow others to ring you without having to listen to a speaker. 
new VHF and HF radio telephones have DSC capability. Let us now go to the frequencies and channels used in VHF, MF, and HF when sending a distress alert. In distress communications, speech and radio telephony must be slow and clear as possible. The primary method of transmitting a distress alert is by using a DSE or digital selective volume. A VHF or very high frequency is used for sending a distress signal in channel 70 via DSC and after sending the alert, you will go to channel 16 to broadcast the Mayday pattern in radio telephony. MF or medium frequency radio on the other hand uses 2182 kHz frequency to broadcast a distress call. HF or high frequency is this is different from DSC because it has five major calling frequency which is HF4, HF6, HF8, HF12, and HF16. There are two types of distress alerting, the designated and the undesignated distress alert. Undesignated distress alert is where you can send undesignated distress if you don't have time to create the message. It can be announced by telephony at channel 16 and there is also a search pattern if you use the designated alert. The rescuers will start at your last position and the alert will also not include information relating to the nature of distress. This is enabled by either pressing a single push button or pair of push buttons, normally covered by a protective flap for a short period of time usually 5 seconds. To execute undesignated distress alert, first locate the distress button. It can be seen under a protective cover that must be slid back before the button can be pressed. Second, when sending the distress call, press and hold the distress key for 5 seconds. A countdown to the transmission will be displayed. Release the key at any time during the countdown to abort the transmission. The next step of distressing is the designated alert. This is enabled by programming the digital selective calling or the DSC controller to include further information relating to the nature of distress and to update the time and position manually if necessary. The designated distress alert is then broadcast by either pressing a single push button or pair of push buttons for 5 seconds after programming. The following are internationally recognized natures of distress. First is the fire or explosion. Next, flooding, collision, grounding, listing or capsizing, sinking, disabled and adrift abandoning, and man overboard. Next is how to send the designated distress alert by digital selective calling. First, you will go to the DSC controller and then press the distress button. Then fill out the information needed for designated distress alert by pressing up and down button. After choosing the nature of distress, press the next button again and then your current position will show and also the time will automatically show next because it is connected with the GPS. Press again the next button, push the button for 3 to 5 seconds and after you release it, the distress signal will be in progress. Following on from the DSC distress alert, the vessel in distress will broadcast a voice on VHF channel 16, a distress message. This will be the pattern. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. This is the name of the vessel in distress spoken three times, call sign, three times, MMSI number, Mayday, name of the vessel, call sign, 
MMSI the, of the vessel in distress, the position, at time, and the type of accident, and then immediate assistance required, and the number of people on board, and other information that could have SAR services such as weather conditions and activated EPIRB or etc. And then over. Here is an example of a distress message on VHF channel 16. Mayday, Mayday, Mayday. This is container vessel MV Condoriano. Container vessel MV Condoriano. Container vessel MV Condoriano. Call sign Charlie Delta Romeo 3. Charlie Delta Romeo 3. Charlie Delta Romeo 3. MMSI 0096512 zero zero. Mayday. This is MV Condoriano. My call sign Charlie Delta Romeo 3 and my MMSI is 00965120. In position 08 degrees 22 minutes north, 113 degrees 52 minutes east at 1300 hours UTC. Cargo containers jettisoned due to heavy weather conditions. Force 10 in the Buford scale is observed. Our vessel is listing to starboard due to instability. Immediate assistance required. I repeat, immediate assistance required. 44 persons on board including the master and due to the heavy weather, we can only remain on board for approximately 5-0 minutes. Search and rescue transponder will be automatically activated after the estimated time over. Next is the distress relay. This can be broadcasted when the coastal radio station learns that there is another vessel in distress and unable to transmit a distress alert itself. For example, red flares are sighted at night or the vessel that is in distress is beyond the VHF range of the coastal radio station. This is an example. Mayday Relay, Mayday Relay, Mayday Relay. This is 1212-905-004, Motor Vessel Nilo, Motor Vessel Nilo, Motor Vessel Nilo. Call sign Bravo Uniform Tango Yankee 1. Receive the following Mayday from MMSI 0096-5. 1200 MV Condor Yano Call sign Charlie Delta Romeo 3 Mayday This is MV Condor Yano My call sign is Charlie Delta Romeo 3 And my MMSI is 00965-1200 In position at 08 degrees 22 minutes north 113 degrees 52 minutes east At 1300 hours UTC Cargo containers jettisoned due to heavy weather conditions. Force 10 in the Buford scale is observed. Our vessel is fisting to starboard due to instability. Immediate assistance required. I repeat, immediate assistance required. 44 persons on board including the master and due to heavy weather, we can only remain on board for approximately 5-0 minutes. Search and rescue transponder will be manually activated after the estimated time. Over. Next is the reception of a distress alert. After the reception of a distress alert on VHF channel 70, a distress message on VHF channel 16 must be listened. Then wait for a coastal radio station to acknowledge the call and for following voice communication on VHF channel 16. If your own vessel is able to assist, Acknowledge the call by radio telephony on VHF channel 16. If a distress alert is not followed by a radio telephony broadcast on VHF channel 16 or acknowledgement by any other station, acknowledge the call by radio telephony on VHF channel 16 and proceed with voice communication on VHF channel 16 and try to notify the shore authorities by any means. Pattern of Acknowledgement of a Distress Call by Radio Telephony 
If you received a distress signal, you must call first the captain and wait for further instructions to acknowledge the distress signal. The following is the pattern and example of how to acknowledge a distress call by radio telephony. This is the pattern of acknowledgement. Mayday, MMSI of the distressed vessel, name of the distressed vessel three times, call sign of the distressed vessel. This is MMSI of your vessel, name of the vessel three times, call sign of the vessel, receive Mayday. Example, Mayday 00965120 MV Condoriano, MV Condoriano, MV Condoriano Call sign Charlie Delta Romeo 3 This is 12002906111 Motor Vessel Ambrosio, Motor Vessel Ambrosio, Motor Vessel Ambrosio Call sign Alpha Victor 22 Receive Mayday